Hey guys, Jared and Jay, back with some more Pokemon Ultra Moon. Um, before we head into Po Town, I do want to run over here. Oops, not over here, over here. Yeah, I saw a TM up there. I don't remember what it is, but I remember it being something fairly decent. It's probably like something poison related. That would potentially be good. This is if anyone can learn it. <laughs> well, that's true. From what I remember from last time, we were struggling to deal with fairy types, so... Yeah. Decent poison move would be nice. Or a steel move that anyone can learn. That would also work. Just something. The two types that no one on our team has learned or has any <laughs> capability of learning. Oh man, it's so nice having someone fast on the team. Yeah. That's kind of one of the reasons I was in favor of switching it out. <laughs> or switching out Arachnid. If it had been a little bit tankier, I would have been fine keeping it, but it was just like slow and not as tanky as it needed to be to be that slow. Alright, so... Well, let's just go left first. I think it was the left path that had it. Yeah, but there is the outside. other stuff. I don't remember where. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought there was a... Oh, Rock Slide. That's alright, I guess. We already know it, unlike the only person that we would teach to, but... Yeah, see, there's a trainer right there. Alright, gotta run back around. <laughs> Loop all the way back. I hate it when they design areas like that, where there's just, like, one little thing that you want to do, but you have to go through the whole thing again. Yeah. And there's another item right there, too. Yeah, I liked it better in, uh, like Ruby and Sapphire when you had the acro bike and the mock bike. Yeah, so you could just jump back up. Yeah. Although I guess you had to have one or the other. Which one was it where you, they let you do both? Like you could switch on the fly? Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Okay. Huh. Hmm. I think that's yeah, the I guess one those, where you could yeah. switch on the fly. I guess those are the only games that really have like the two distinct types of like. Uh, yeah, because in fourth gen they just went back to a regular bike, right? I think so. I don't remember. It's been so long since I've actually like played through those games all the way. No, right? I know they at least. Well, I don't think they had like the acro bike stuff of like bunny hopping and jumping around and that kind of stuff, but I think that one you could switch you could switch between having you like switched gears on the bike, but all that did was one of them was faster and harder to control and the other one just went at like the set speed and was easier to control. But I don't think there are any like trick spots or anything. I yeah, think about right. I honestly don't remember either. <laughs> I'm it's pretty sure rain. that's what it is, but I guess we'll find out if we ever get around to playing one of those uh, Platinum ROM packs. Yeah. That is true. I don't think there's anything on the last path, just grab. Yeah, it just like loops back into the original path. Um, Alright, now that we're done with that got a TM we really didn't need. Ready to live Ready his team live. skull. Yeah, I am. Sure. I'll be a criminal. I have reasons for doing what I do. As he shoots <laughs> up with heroin. <laughs> like, dang, y'all. You can really make a place, like, dirty and filthy while it's continuously covered in rain. Really At least there's a sticker on the Pokemon Center today. So that's something. True. I am a lazy piece of shit. Not unless you find some path through here. Well, I guess we gotta leave then. <laughs> Clearly they've made an impassable barrier. Wait, can I... 
Can you go? You can get no, away. of course not. <laughs> of course not. There's all of this literally nothing <laughs> blocking the way. <laughs> they couldn't even like put like another tree or bush or something there. It's like actually just completely open. Because I'm not even getting stopped at the bush back there. I'm getting stopped yeah, here. No, it's just by like the hitbox of the tree. <laughs> that was uh, that was some shoddy design. <laughs> Yeah. It's not great. <laughs> More stickers. Oh, oh, got stuck on this board. Man, they really made weird hitboxes on these things. Can't step over this fucking board. Heaven forbid. Yes, my skull is a rock. A rock'em sock'em robot. No, you just have the rocket ability. It's fine. Yeah. So I'm just gonna take him down. I see what you did there. Uh, what? What did I do? I'll tell you what I'm about to do. You like what's there? Well, now that you say that, no. Use Hydro Vortex. Duh. <laughs> So much overkill. Nah, man, it's a spinner rack. That thing's dangerous. It could use, like, sticky web or, like, string shot or leech life. Hey, man, don't joke about leech life. That's a real move now. That one actually would hurt, too, because we're part psychic. <laughs> yeah, that'd be real bad. <laughs> oh, but look at all that experience I got. I didn't even see the bar move. <laughs> yeah. Uh... Good run, Interest homie. Interesting wording there. Hey man, bear kids make me soft too. Always getting soft blocked by those barricades. Hmm, interesting. Literal really garbage. <laughs> Your team is trash. Yeah. See, we're on the same page there. Get wrecked. I mean, at least, you know, to his credit, he never stops dancing. I guess. Aw, oh, except for now. I guess he's finally lost the will to live. Well, there we go. See, all you gotta do is come up and stand here and not talk to him. Sticker. And can't get any further for no reason. <laughs> this you don't even get as far and it just blocks you because you'd be out of view. Yeah. Blocked by the camera range. That's why they really need to get to uh Ready for fly rhymes in your ear, yo? But yo, what are you doing here, yo? Whoa, darker than dark eye up in here. Why are you scared when you met a Firo? Spin, 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 spin. We can, we can. This is awesome. This is like my favorite song ever. Sounds good, yo. Here's some fucking money, yo. Here's ten bucks, so you can maintain your power bill, even though that's really honestly, like, a dime. Yeah. <laughs> Here's ten cents, have fun with that. I'm glad they felt comfortable making you pay at this Pokemon Center, because it was such a small amount that they're like, there's no way that anyone ever would not be able to afford this. Right. Like, you'd have to really go out of your way to not be able to afford that. No, fight me. I'm right here, fight me. There you go. <laughs> Bonjour! I'm back from Kalos region. What's Kalos supposed to be? That's like Germany, right? It's France. They say bonjour in Germany. Oh, you're right. I always consider France to just be a part of Germany. It's only a matter of time before they take it over again. 
you get the chance, can you restart, restart the call real quick? It dropped on my end again. Yeah, just like. sec. <laughs> I'll just picture what's going on. <laughs> Not much. <laughs> I didn't even see most of that. I chose an attack and then just fixed the call, and it was over by the time that I uh, had the call running again. Perfect. Ooh, all of a sudden I was beset upon by two women tossing balls. <laughs> uh, normal Sunday. Yep. Seems legit. Hmm, interesting. Grunt and cool grunt. Names. I'll give him two grunts. Be about it, though. Uh, Tyranitrum looks so cool. <laughs> so much better now. I think I'm hearing you things. You don't need to see a move. Nah, I'm hearing things. No. Blacking out over here. Really wish we had a psychic move, like that was actually good. Yeah, we'll get one pretty soon. I think it was at like level 45. It's rock slide. Yep. There you go. Aww, no quick claw this time. Oh no! <laughs> Guess we're not switching out. Well, that sucks. Wow, we were actually just normally faster than that Raticate. Yeah, I mean, Tyranitrum is like medium speed. Yeah, I guess. It's probably the second fastest member on our team. No, that's not true. We have Hunchcrow. Oh, yeah, you're right. And Gardevoir is not really slow. I think it's about the same speed as Tyranitrum. Hmm, interesting. Really? Fire fang in the rain? Yeah, why not? I mean, it's not gonna matter, because it would get to go, but... I'm stronger than the one next to me. I'm just as good as the woman next to me, right? So there's one of them that's constantly asserting her superiority, as the other one's constantly asserting that they're equal. That's yep. An interesting relationship. <laughs> yeah, at some point we should, uh... feed Bruxish some poke beans so it gets the boosted XP. Uh, yeah. Just noticed in that battle it wasn't getting it. I'll do that after this. I don't yeah, think don't that, do uh... That. That's it, but right now. I don't think I even have the necessary beans. I'm all beaned out. And as exciting as it always is to sit and scoop up beans... I don't yeah, I probably don't need to show that. <laughs> Can't animate this because it's too complicated, apparently. Aw, oh, an impervious gate. Hey look, that's not that's dangerous, man. You shouldn't do that. <laughs> yeah, especially in the rain. It's probably pretty slick up there. I really don't understand what this is supposed to be like a reference to. I don't either. <laughs> I remember being confused by that the first time I saw it, too. But I can't imagine it's just, like, completely random, because it makes no sense. <laughs> I mean, it's gotta be a reference to something. I just genuinely don't know what. <laughs> I don't know. Must be, like, an old person thing. Either that or, like, a really, really young Bad person thing. I mean, I guess, I guess it could be that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that pun might make more sense in Japanese. <laughs> it's kind of what I'm assuming. But then you'd think, I mean, usually when that happens, they just, like, completely throw the old, like, the pun away and just, like, translate it to something else. Make some other, like, random joke that's not even remotely the same. Uh, yeah, that's true. They do normally do that. Oh man. What a loser, Solanda. It can't even evolve. I'll put you out of your misery. Kill it. Yep. It can never evolve. It's a rough life. Yeah, I'm still not sure how much of a- ooh, nice. 
Still not sure how much of a fan I am of that whole thing. Huh, I guess it was only level 41 we needed to get to. Sweet. Well, we have pretty much our full move set on that guy now. Yeah. Disable. Gonna keep that in. Use that on the Elite Four. Well, okay. We we'll get rid of that. But we have our three important moves. No, nah, man. Disable. Gonna use that on the Elite Four. Disable every move. <laughs> oh. Oh, you can get over from the other side. Okay. What's this X? Is there something here? Nope. Just a nope. random X on the ground. It's just marking a whole lot of nothing. Hey, there's another one. Oh, no, what the hell? Oh, it's one of those, uh... things that evolves into Galisopod. Or whatever its name is. I do like how there's an arrow pointing. You can go here. <laughs> <laughs> just in case you couldn't tell. In case you didn't notice it, just want to be very, very obvious. Even though it's like also like still on a side path. <laughs> hey, I'm here now! Surprise! Ooh, a faux mantis. How dangerous a foe this is. I really just don't understand that pose. Yeah, I, I don't get that one either. <laughs> it just seems so weird. Cause I mean like the one that the guys do like is also stupid, but it at least like um it at least is supposed to like kind of mimic a skull. <laughs> right. Uh whatever. Who cares? Aw, oh, don't be such a marini. Wow. I say as I then Tear it asunder. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that was a psychic move. <laughs> a physical psychic move that we get boosted damage on because of strong jaw or lock jaw or whatever it's called. That's honestly really strong. Well, because we get Good stabbed throw. plus it's boosted 50%, right? Yep. <laughs> and it's base, what, like 80 ish? So if we look here, it's hard to see from this angle. But this guy's waving, and there's a guy in there that's just waving back. <laughs> yep. He's like, oh, are we getting invaded? They're just waving, man. Yeah. You can talk to the other guy once you invade the base, and he's like, Oh, the dude's waving, that's so nice. <laughs> Come grab these stickers. Yep. Then okay. Thanks. Yeah, you gotta go the other way. Yeah, go outside. Get, get those from the pool. Oh good. Oops. Oh oh. Gotta watch out yeah. for these liquor bottles on the floor. It's a real shady <laughs> house there. Good one. Is it because of the shade that they're constantly throwing? Yep, that's what I was going for. Hey, the only ice stone in the game outside of Pokepelago. Alright, well, we'll come investigate that guy later. If we manage to become as powerful as Mr. Guzma. Sticker! Oh, look, and another, another one! Sticker. Oh, look, another one! And another sticker! I wonder who put those there so lazily. What does he keep staring at me? Does he see how hot I am or something? Just keep waving. <laughs> Such a. This. Sneak in here. <laughs> hey, Max Revive, nice. I'm pretty sure you actually don't even have to get the passwords, I'm pretty sure you can just enter them. By the way, there's a, a point at which you need passwords in this house, but... Yeah, I don't think you have to pick them up as long as you enter them directly. And then once you defeat the boss, you can just wander through and not have to battle any trainers. You can actually get through almost this entire house with, like, no battles. <laughs> Why would you want to do that? I don't know, lazy. Or, like, if you were me in our last playthrough trying to catch back up to where we were before. <laughs> ah, that's, that's a fair point. <laughs> Boom, get wrecked. So good. <laughs> Is it 100% accuracy? I'm not sure. 
That's a good question. Now that we're out oh. of the rain, we can use some fire moves. It's like all the other fang moves aren't 100% accuracy, but this one might be. I don't know. I'm also just curious because Aqua Tail is... Um, Not. <laughs> yeah, it's 90%. Oh, there we go. Get wrecked. I mean, honestly, yes. it kind of makes sense to not have, like, every move at 100%. It's kind of weird how, like, for the longest time, like, almost every single move was 100%, and then they added can't miss. <laughs> Poison job. I can't think of it as the actual TM. It'd be great. Uh, I think you can get that here, actually. Somewhere in this house, I believe. <laughs> He never got a Z power ring as a handicap. Uh huh. Fucking your handicap. Handicap. <laughs> That's what it was. <laughs> well, you know, when you're someone as naturally advantaged as Mr. Guzma, <laughs> sometimes people get jealous and, you know, they just, uh, they call you handicapped. It's rough. It's a rough life. <laughs> More trash. Oh, it hasn't missed yet. Well, way to jinx it. Hey! Well, at least we're staying pretty on pace with being a couple levels higher than everybody. That's nice. Yeah, it's true. I was kind of pleasantly surprised to see that. For how we completely redid the entire team. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, everyone's now finally catching up. I feel like I've heard someone say that before. <laughs> Your full course, it's got way too much seasoning. And I'm like, that's right, it does. Give you some seasoning. And then I throw salt in their face. <laughs> I was wondering where you were going with that. That's about where I thought. <laughs> yeah. Well, you don't do pepper because then, you know, they sneeze. So you gotta do salt. <laughs> Man, they really shouldn't leave their password just lying around. It's not yeah, very good literally security. just lying on the floor. <laughs> well, the best part is just like, oh, but we have guards. It's like, no, you don't. You have like three random trainers that have like one or two Pokemon each. That's not really guards. <laughs> It's yeah. just people. That I'm an incomplete grunt. <laughs> uh. So what are you? Are you like unt? Or are you like gruh? <laughs> hey gruh. What's up? Well. Well, he has that. <laughs> yeah. I can see now why he considers himself... Incomplete. Also, isn't that only like one level away from evolving? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it evolved before that. I well, this one didn't. <laughs> if it ha yeah, it's certainly close to evolving at least. I mean, maybe he just needed like to fight one more trainer to level it up, and this is not going to be the fight that it happens. Yeah, you mean beat one more trainer? <laughs> True. So it will never evolve. <laughs> See? Poison Sludge Bomb. Poison Sludge Bomb. I think maybe Honchkrow can get that? Uh, I don't know. Let's take a look. It won't really help us right now, but... Nope. God damn it. <laughs> no, buddy. Of course. Oh. O. M. G. Oh, no wonder it stinks. <laughs> That's a lovely aroma. Should I write our names on them? <laughs> our names are all grunt. <laughs> I like how they broke the fourth wall there a bit. That's great. Ooh, a boy! <laughs> Guess we'll have to teach him a lesson. And I'm just like, please don't touch me. <laughs> oh, please fighting! Don't. Okay, thank God. <laughs> Ah, yes. Good old fighting women. My favorite pastime. Uh-oh. 
better watch out. Better not cry. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, it was just Christmas like two weeks ago. We have 11 and a half months until Christmas. <laughs> As soon as it's Boxing Day, it's no longer Christmas. That is objectively correct. <laughs> Guess I really am just a grunt. That was, like, totally uncool. I'll get revenge for you while still wearing your skull tank. Like, <laughs> what? Why do you need to specify that? <laughs> I'm glad you decided to not remove your clothing to fight me, I guess. <laughs> That's kind of strange to feel the need to specify it, though. Ah, the evolved form. Equally as pointless. Yep. <laughs> yeah, just zoom a bit so we don't get hit by a dark move. Well, I mean, if it used Sucker Punch, it still would have hit us. That's true. Thankfully, it did not, though, as you can see from the fact that it didn't. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> yeah, that does not look very fun. That's one of the more painful looking Z moves. Yeah. I mean, well, there's a bunch of pretty painful looking ones, but that's one of definitely the more painful. I think the only one I can think of that looks worse is the fighting one. The fighting one does look pretty bad. <laughs> you just get the shit beat out of you. Hmm, interesting. Oh, what do you mean I can't read that from right here? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is an RPG. That's what you're supposed to do. Yeah, it's pretty it's pretty standard. Standard practice. It is interesting that we're getting lectured on morals by the <laughs> the team skull grunts. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's definitely a little ironic. Isn't it ironic? A little too ironic. <laughs> I'm such a good singist. Oh, you know what we forgot to do? What? We never went and got the Psychic Z Crystal. Oh, uh, yeah. It's not a bad idea. Well, I mean, it also won't really help us hear any, so we can deal with that after we get through this area. Um. Yeah. yeah, that'll work. Why not? YOLO. Bring it on. And then use your Kamehameha. I guess that's probably closer to a special beam cannon. I suppose. Man, I haven't watched that in a long time. Oh, you mean you haven't been watching Super? <laughs> no, I haven't. I haven't Should either, I but I haven't heard amazing things about it. Well, sorry, I've heard amazing things, but not like in a this is an excellent anime way. <laughs> hmm, that's not encouraging. I need to see if I can get Dan to send me a link. I don't know if he has a link or if he's just like got some of the images saved off, but there's this whole thing about how a lot of the art was like poorly or like too quickly done in Super. <laughs> there's like one, there's one image he's sent me like three or four times that's fantastic, which is it's Vegeta from behind and you can see like whoever he's like walking towards to fight or whatever is going on. I have no idea because I haven't seen the show at all. And so they drew like knuckle texture lines on the back of his gloves. And so it's weird though because it it shows the palm of his left hand. The way that he's like got his arms bent or uh, is showing the palm of his left hand and the back of his right hand. I think is what it huh. is. Um, 
but they accidentally drew the like sh shading slash texture lines the same way <laughs> so it makes it look like he has two left hands <laughs> <laughs> It's, like, a really, like, subtle, like, easy thing to, like, accidentally do, but you would think that, like, some amount of quality Someone control would, would notice it. that. Because the internet caught it pretty immediately. <laughs> of course. Um, yeah, there's a bunch of things like that. There's somewhere... <laughs> they really... I don't know if they just, like, don't have the same size, like, staff that they used to or what, but, uh... There's some stuff where, uh... I'm just gonna go heal real quick. Uh, then I guess Probably we'll... Only cost 10 cents. Yeah. Uh, uh, I don't know how to get over there. Yeah, I guess that is the one downside. It takes a bit to get back to Pokemon Center. Uh, shit, is it all the way back? God. No, is it, is it just Wait. to the right? Is it? Am I wrong about that? No, yeah, I am wrong about that. Well, um, that's annoying. Anyway, there's another picture that's pretty good, which shows, I think it's Goku, it might be Vegeta, like, way in the distance. And their face has, like, no detail on it at all. <laughs> it's like a ditto face, practically. <laughs> <laughs> it's really, it's fantastic. I kind of want to watch it just because of that, but I can't find, uh... As in, I haven't looked on any online services for where to watch it, and I can't find a decent price on the physical set. Is it on Funimation? I don't know. Maybe. Check. I think it might be on there. Alright, so I guess we'll... Go turn in the passwords, and then... Go fight Guzman next time. Sounds good. I doubt that's gonna be a quick fight. Yeah, that might take a bit. I mean, hopefully it's not too bad now that our team's kind of up to snuff, but... Oh, I don't want to use Bruxish, though. Oh, yeah, definitely not. <laughs> Probably won't use it at all. <laughs> Bug-type thing. <laughs> no, it's Psychic-type. Alright, let's see if we get these passwords right. Uh, who do I want to put in? Uh, sure, why not? Okay. Yes. Which is really counterintuitive because it says to say no. Poison jab. Poison jab. Bound, Bound sweet. sweet. Tapu Coco. Which is fair. Which is a, that's a great name. <laughs> no. No. You're one the of us, Bonehead. The game, that did confuse me a little bit. It's like no to the last bit. <laughs> At least an original Southern Moon. Hey! 61, nice. We made some good sticker progress this episode. That's true. Escape rope, which I don't think you can use to leave this building. Probably not. I don't really know where you can use it. I've never used one in these games, but... Alright, uh, next time we'll stuff. clear out the last couple guards and then take on Guzma. So thanks for watching. Yep. See you later.